have one more bomb. I believe that chest is something I can reach with a bomb. It's worth taking a peek again. Yeah. Go for maximum low uppy. Yeah, I had to choose between Seeker Wall and a chest that I knew about. Strength Serum. Gotta pop my ears. It's possible that the Seeker Wall would have given me some better results, but... You never know. We've gotten some pretty bad Seeker Rooms and some pretty good Seeker Rooms. It's true, a secret room could have had anything. But that chest could have had anything inside of it. Let the bird learn! <coughs> could have had a boat! With a chest on the boat. Don't need to heal. Could use a bomb. We'll grab a bomb. I don't see any reason not to. Well, now the food is looking appealing. Trying to figure out if Mighty Odin is arguing with himself? Let's talk about Gwyneth Paltrow and Goop. What the fuck? Why? Like, it sounds like you're arguing with yourself. I mean, Gwyneth Paltrow and Goop is a very short conversation. Snake oil salesmen have been a thing forever. And this is just the latest iteration of that. Preying upon folks that trust her because of her celebrity status and taking advantage of them. It's nothing new. Fucking she she's doing that for for one audience and then Alex Jones is doing it for another. Tale as old as time. Two bombs, two keys. Again, two bombs, two keys, but the bomb is much more worth my while now. Or do I want to use a key? You know what? I'll make that choice after I see more rooms. It could be I end up with 37 keys soon, you know? You never know. The pilfers! Distract my eyes, and I lose track of what is an enemy and what is a pilfer. Ooh, what is this? Projectile while swinging. Yes, please. <laughs> I'm not... not seeing a projectile. <laughs> I'm seeing my orb, but I'm not seeing projectile. Ooh. Oil almost got me. She's a modern huckster. A con man, a confidence man. <laughs> Much like a number of currently in office politicians. It's 
today has been a, a big old pile of depressing chat conversation, hasn't it? This all started when we were like, it's hard to read the news because it makes you depressed, <laughs> and then we just did it to ourselves anyway. Irresponsible, that's what we are. Mini chest! Oh, we got strength, serum, antimatter. Antimatter is the next damage heals me, right? Yeah, let's drink the strength serum. It'll run out eventually, but I'd rather get a new thing, you know? People need to learn how to talk about things, though. It's true. Again, I'm not saying I regret it. Secret room? Oh, I almost missed it. I don't mind these conversations. Otherwise, I would just straight up be like, let's talk about something else. And at no point was this like, Creedmore, you're wrong and you should stop talking, because I've noticed you've, you've stopped talking. There's definitely no right or wrong in our conversation. Boss room's an empty room because the boss is dead forever. Already at full health, don't need that. Hot cocoa and oatmeal. Why not why not make the hot cocoa in the oatmeal? Make chocolate oatmeal. You'd like to go back to the eighties? Eighties to nineties where like, again, it falls back to what I was talking about before, but the reason why I wouldn't be opposed to that particular period is it was an upward swing. Like, 80s, 90s, the early oddies, like, this was the LGBTQ community becoming slightly more accepted, climbing up that hill until it became mainstream, it was in movies, and then you get to the oddies and it's legalized. It's, it's the climb towards something better, and that's what I think is important. I feel like we need that in society. We need to feel like we're progressing towards something bigger than us, something more important than our meager, everyday lives. It's why when people are like, the space program is a waste of money, what's up there? And it's like, it's, it's more than just the fact that we've been to the moon already, like, it's this big common goal that's lofty and idealized and something for us to strive toward. And sure, the money can go toward other things, but I feel like if we're looking at where money can be taken from, it's the military budget. It's probably where we should be taking some money. Chocolate and sea salt oatmeal, and it tastes like cocoa pebbles. So that sounds delicious. That sounds great. I feel like the the very short answer is if you go to those time periods, I think you'll find a sense of like excitement and hope where it's like, yeah, man, who knows? We'll probably have flying cars soon. And that general sense is dead. It's dead. <laughs> oh, he's so sleepy. Like, I'm not looking at the future and thinking like, oh man, I can't, can't wait to see what we're gonna have. I'm more like, 
having an overall sense of dread these days, where it's like, boy, we're gonna find out in a few months whether or not our, our democracy will die. <laughs> if we're gonna fall into fascism, that's exciting. It's not. It's terrifying and scary, and I don't like it. I hate the cauldrons. Two keys, yeah. Invites Calamity. I think that was the missing part when I couldn't understand this last time. You're just... Looking at, like, stuff like 18th, 19th century. I mean, again, I mentioned before, if you look at all of human history, of course, there are worse times. McCarthyism was probably comparable to where we are at the moment. Uh, dying in our first winter as settlers would probably be sucky. Oh, the purple candle is something I definitely am thinking about blowing up, especially since we have Kurtz's stash. Like, we actively want to blow these up with Kurtz's stash, I think. I was just remarking, like, I didn't understand that part of Kurtz's stash last time. The Invites Calamity. I believe we get extra prizes every time we blow up one of these boys. There we go. Antimatter Float Potion. Yeah. Oh, I think it's just one torch is out and one torch is lit. Five curses and it opens? Really? What's the countdown? You see how uh, it had ten charges? I broke the thing and it went down to nine charges? I thought it was a countdown thing. We're looking to, like, get the ten things. Oh, we just want ten curses. All right. That's a lot of curses. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to be a good thing in the end. I think Milchug is only departing temporarily, if I understand correctly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, yeah, let's grab a bomb. Get out of the water! Oh. I was like, that's a lot of water. A temporary goodbye. Son of a bitch. Of course, they're gonna alternate, so I'll never have a safe moment. That's how it works. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, no, that's real good. That's amazing. I need to capitalize on that as much as possible. I love that the pilfers don't count as enemies. Basically, it's get in the room and start swinging. Oh, hold on. Benji has to go into the other room. He's very excited. Alright, Benji, I got you. Benji's outside, but... Brother should let him in for me. Ah, oh, Lost audio. In one ear. How come you're not shooting? There's enemies over there, shoot! I really want to fix my, my headphone. There we go. Where are you aiming, bug? I'm 
I'm sorry. What's going on with wire? I'm very confused on the layout of this wire at the moment. Oh my god, yeah, no. <laughs> Learning a trade. Getting an apprenticeship, that's... That's some sound advice right there. I would never trade my college experience. If, even if I had Time Machine, I would still be... be the woefully indebted person I am now. Just because the experiences I had were... <coughs> very enjoyable. <coughs> but I probably wouldn't recommend it to other people. Machinist is a good one. Oh right, I was going for the secret room. Sorry, I'm, I'm lightly distracted. I'm trying to keep my ear open to figure out if uh, Benji's on his way back up the stairs or not. You're throwing a shoe at the monitor. All right, secret room. Let's find it. Oh, look, gold in a wall. What was I doing again? Right, leave it. No, let's uh, blow this up. This better be the best secret room in the world. I mean, it replaced my bomb and gave me a new one. So that's pretty good. It's all right, I guess. A mi oh, another secret room. Why did I do that? I knew where it went. Uh, I just saw the sparkle and I didn't think. Oh, boy. 3,000 gold, though. We're doing pretty good on money. Is there health lying around anywhere? Uh, antimatter potion could heal me. I should drink that when we have a, a damaging monster around. Oh, I didn't go into the candle room. There could have been some wall money there. That's fine. No big deal. I have one key. I mean, relics are power. Crits temporarily increase crit chance. We've got some crit synergy going on. Yeah, I don't I don't think the military's done that for a little while now. There was a legitimate period of time where I was worried that my brother was going to have to His first combat experience would be against his fellow Americans when they're like, yeah, we're thinking about deploying uh folks from uh stations in America to deal with protests. It's like, oh my god, they're mentioning Fort Drum. I swear to god, if my brother's first military deployment was against fellow Americans, that would be real dark. Why do I blow up every once in a while? Oh, it's that guy! You dick! Didn't even notice. Alright, I can hear Benji coming back up. Let me go. Let me go collect the dog. I return. 78 health. All right. Getting some heals is high on my list right now. Uh, definitely yes. Three bombs is worth it. Can't even tell them apart. It's like there's two Benjis there. Look at that. They're exactly the same.
Shoot the boy. Shoot the boy. Oh, thank you very much for the follow, Malix. You had a message that I didn't see in time because of this dumb setup at the moment. Game looks fascinating. Ugh. Don't have time to watch. What a fool you've been. Well, thanks for popping in. Thanks for the follow. And I'll see you next time you're around. We'll be playing more of this game going forward. We do jump around, though. 15 health? No, I'm trying to heal. It's possible to give me health, though. Oh, good lord. No! God, I hate that guy. He has so much health. Ooh. He just slides around it. Get out of here. That was a big crit. How many of us know we're supposed to be doing it? 19. Oh, a treat? And she's like, oh. Hold on, I have to get more treat. Treat bench? My mini treat dispenser was empty. Oh, he's already here. Here you go, buddy. Oh. Eat that tree. Dark matter potion. All right, I do need to heal. I just need to plan ahead for a good hit. Hmm. You can go most of your life without knowing. That's the truth. Fire some fireballs. Ah, huh. torches we gotta light. I mean, I think this'll do it. What's our curse, by the way? Lose a bomb when you take damage. Oh boy. So let's drink the antimatter potion. <clears throat> That'll just be in effect until we take damage. Then we'll drink this potion in here. Ah, oh, so close! Aha! Three keys! Come on, did you see how hard that was? Was the shop selling keys? Nope. I could take a curse for an item. Okay. Got one shot? Uh, the magic about life is you actually have way more than one shot. I encourage you all to come across this very dangerous trap to try and get me. Shit. Sucker.
<laughs> Float potion. Oh boy. I think I took damage at some point. Antimatter potion is no longer on my bar. Well, I have been saying I need more curses. Really? Have your own pillow, you have to sleep on both of my pillows? That's fine, whatever, Benji. Get more curses. <laughs> Bombs, brand enemies for sacrifice, plus 10 bombs. Lock a hit once in a while. So three curses. I feel like this is two curses and this is six curses? Because these are big skulls. These are small skulls. Nope, I think it's just three bad curses, huh? Healing is less effective. Dropping a bomb costs two bombs. Decrease swing speed. Oh, stupid bomb stuff. Six more curses I need. Oh well, it's a good gold run at the very least. We're making, making bank. Zero keys, great. Let the bird do it. You're doing great, bird. What is this now? Oh ho, my girl, in the house, Black Rabbit's chess game house. What do you say? You pay me 1,200 gold and you can open three chests. It's a good deal. Well, that ruins it. Wait, did I, ar did I already pay her? I didn't say yes. <laughs> well, that's a key. I was keeping track of the the triple your your shot and at that last move where they all pile on top of each other is like, great, I'm glad I spent the time trying to figure out where it was going. Uh, well, I'll save the key for now. The shop is obviously pretty, pretty worth my while. But a relic would also be worth my while. She's the best NPC. She robs me every time. It's highway robbery. That's the only reason why you like her. <clears throat> oh, electric bugs, I hate you. Go forth! They can't hurt me. This is truly the coward's way to fight, but... Oh, I still have my boots! You're right! <laughs> oh 
How do I keep forgetting about my boots? Yeah. I'd like to apologize on behalf of my boots. Rather, I'd like to apologize to my boots. I've even used a float potion thinking I was smart. A couple of floors back. I need a bomb. Unfortunately, bombs cost two bombs, so I need two bombs. Yeah, we are pilot on the crits, it's nice. Gently. Gently. Well, I wanted a bomb. Oh, I wanted more bombs. No! What happened? How'd I blow up? Thieves! God damn it. Oh, one of the curses is if I take damage, I drop a bomb, and then I blew myself up. That was a lot of damage, real fast. It's alright. Now we have a new thing hanging out. Expand the shop's special item inventory. The words VERY GOOD are written in large, bold letters, and the R is backwards. Expand the shop's food supply. Expand the shop's item supply. I mean, obviously I want the special item supply. My name is Just Down, you're right. Just Down. Now I'm Royka. Fred around. Juana. Cliff Blood. Anla. Lafark. Juanice. Arthens. Saria. Willen. Anan. Janshaun. Wan. Wangan. I'll be Wangan. <laughs> Let's just improve shops overall. It's a hell of a pirate name. It's one hell of a pirate. Alright, let's do another run. Right, what's my blessing? Healing is more effective. Okay, that's a pretty good one. Not gonna say no to that. Nothing else in there. Let's try and actually make it to another boss for a change. I would like some more meta monies. It has been quite some time since they stay dead forever if you beat them. What is that? Rook's Bomb. Death at 90 degrees. Oh, my bird levels up if I pick up the gold as well. Interesting. We might be able to make something else appear if we uh, light these torches, so if we can get fire. Cross shape boom, big boomy. Sounds nice. Oh, you dick. Huh. 
Oh, <laughs> I freaked out when it landed next to me. Mush booms. Oh, that's not the kind of thing I wanted. I was looking for fire, but I won't say no. This chain lightning owns. More torches that I could light on fire if I had fire. Gesticulating wildly to where fire would be. You're very tired and trash at chess. Zero keys, boo! That's very disappointing. Oh well. Uh, keys, nothing I can do about it. I'd be very curious to find out if I really do level up my bird by picking up the gold, or if the bird has to do the picking up. Because that would change how I uh, go about a few things. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Throw it over here! Quick, throw a bomb! Throw it! Throw it! Nice. It's my gold. Still zero keys. I didn't even notice. Ooh. Guess we want to. Got a bomb back out of that. <laughs> Throw a shoe. Yeah, they're Bomberman bombs. Yeah, I got that secret room. I found it. Friend! Come get me. I love your work, Charging Chuck. <gasps> no, I was gonna use you to heal. Oh shits! Get out of here. Can I not find one key down here, really? Mm. Yes, I do like that the enemies can interact with the traps and everything. Could place a bomb. There are four of them, there's a chance. Damn it. Oh, but wait, fire. All right, we gotta go quick. Question mark room, I believe, had torches for us. Or was that the previous floor? Previous floor, boo! Come on, torches for me to light. Just 
just die. Oh, son of a... Hey, a key! Perfect! Not exactly what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Yeah. Alright, golden popcorn. Free ceiling key. Don't be lazy, you walk down those stairs. Oh yeah, look at those shop expansions. Buy a key for sure. You know what? I see no reason not to buy those either. Floor done, let's get out of here. Oh, you know I'm still missing wall golds. Every once in a while I'm just going to not notice some good wall golds. Yeah, gold popcorn. Tell me, Rip, how have your runs in this game been going? That's a lot of bombs, friend. I also haven't played since the last time I played. What a quinky dink. I'm going to have these guys destroy everything in this room. There will be nothing left. do better when you're synchronized in your throws. Oh, good dude! Yeah, yeah! Stand there! Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's helpful. That's a helpful monster. You've been playing the Warframe update? I've heard a lot of good things about it. People have been talking about it. Apparently there's like a major twist or something and people are blown away by it. There we go. Ah yes, my favorite room. I mean I have to go that way eventually, so let's assume that the rest of these directions are dead ends. These bombs are great. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. It's my gold. Woo. Baseball better than the last second. Vox Solaris rep. I'm unsure about that. Ooh, a message was deleted. What was deleted? Spike. What? Kill you things first and then take advantage of my charge and chuck friend.
thank you. Secret passageway. Where'd that bomb come from? Uh, three keys. Throw really fast. Alright. If I can get some other synergies with that, that could prove to be very lucrative. Torches. If we could find fire. Something something internet is wonders enough to play something something. You can make that jump? I don't know about that one. Let me let me visualize it. Oh hell no. I don't have the boots anymore, you can't fool me. Oh, well, Gumper knows exactly what Gumper's saying. Nice little choke point. I need to get some synergy for throwing. He got me. Little jerk. All right, what we got? Savagery serum. Five bombs. I could blow up some rocks. Exit. Good work, bird. Well, let's go get the meat that's lying around. So now I wish I had my boots again. There we go. Hello. Kobe the cheese, how's it going? Did the shop have anything else I was interested in? I'm at full health again, so... Don't need that, I don't see a reason to go into the blessing room. Doing fine working on a game, what game are you working on? When you say working on a game, do you mean like developing a game? In which case... Tell me more. Or if you're playing a game, tell me what you're playing. Hmm. Alright, what curse did we get? Lock costs are converted to health. Yeah, but how much health is the question? Like Dominion. So when you say you're making a you're making a card game, deck builder. I have indeed played some Dominion. Yeah, I know. Give me six keys and makes the cost health. It's great. Ooh, cooperative deck builder. Especially now that it's gone. I would also play that. Is it like any other cooperative card slash deck builders? 
out there. I'm trying to think of an example of a cooperative deck builder. Bloodborne is, is a semi-cooperative deck builder. The Harry Potter game is a cooperative deck builder. I swear, the slimes. They sound a lot like in Super Monkey Ball. <coughs> the monkeys. Those disgusting monkeys. Don't you stop my bird from collecting gold. He just grabbed money and killed himself with it. You've only played Dominion and Star Realms before. You tuned in when I first started this game. How are you liking it? I am enjoying it quite a bit. It has a nice sense of progression to it. Like a lot of roguelikes, you... You play them and you unlock stuff, but it doesn't really feel like much is going on. Especially once you've, like, beaten it a few times. But this one... Like, if you beat a boss, that boss is dead. So, like... Ah, uh, you're going- I'm going through the gold mine. We're gonna find the boss arena. The boss arena is vacant. That boss is just dead forever. And I think that's super interesting. The screams make me sad, says Gomper. Ah! Alright, we got two curse torches in here. I could blow up. Super Monkey Ball is definitely on the list of games we might have to play one day. Super Monkey Ball is a lot of fun. It's dumb, and I love it. Do it, always do it. I mean, I have three bombs. That would be two out of my three bombs. I gotta wait and see if other opportunities present themselves. Ooh, see? I already got another bomb. And there's a lot of, like, persistent upgrades you make on your character. Two bombs! And a free rat! So, for instance, I've gotten my pickaxe up to level 3, my, my clothing up to level 3, my gloves up to level 4, level 2 counterweight, my bombs are level 3, my sacks level 3. These items have all been permanently added to my collection. I got these things going on. The game's telling me something. Make it a very spicy run. I mean, I can't resist the siren call. Very well. It gave me the bombs needed to do this for free, so let's do it. Hearing more bombs. Sack of bombs, health. And potion lets me make fireballs. Just drink it, why not? Now I got nine bombs, eight keys, and our curses are decreases throw speed, all enemies ignite the peasant. My throw speed's back to normal. Got the shop. I mean, I got eight keys. I see no reason not to do this. I'll be lit on fire every time I get hit. Awesome. I was kind of hoping to get rid of that one. It's a lot of angry rats! No! Bad rats! You remind me of that game that I'll only ever play if chat makes me. Since I'm pretty sure I own that game. Oh, the pilfers are adorable. I don't think anyone would ever disagree with that. But yeah, just to show you, here's the boss arena. It's empty because it's dead. I killed it. I like that. I like that it's a persistent world that we are changing. It's going in a direction. I like that. It feels like it's a roguelike, but with non-roguelike elements as well. 
I wonder if I place the bomb here. Yeah, it did reach. Doing good work, bird. Ooh. No one can stop us now. <laughs> Duroc, no. Uh, there's a game called Bad Rats. It's like one of the worst games ever made. I'm pretty sure I own it. Because someone wanted to torture me with it at one point. Oh, our exit's more curses. Well then. Transmutagen Blast transforms items. We already have a bomb. Gain two points of armor. Armor increases damage. Let's do it. You guys want a spicy run? Let's spice this run up. Cost health to plant bombs. Decreases potion duration. <laughs> duration. Cost health to use a key. <coughs> Great. Well, I know I don't have to take, but I want to. We're in it for the spicy now. It's a spicy run. What is it this time, Benji? <laughs> Fine. Hold on. <laughs> 